Hey there, my name is Steven Ryan. I'm the CEO and founder of conveyyour.com. And we had uh, customers coming to us all the time asking, what's a good e-signing tool? Uh, what's one that, that is simple to use, easy to set up, has great pricing? Uh, and we did the search and we integrated actually with a bunch of other ones until we find, found SignWell. Uh, and we said, you know what, let's just refer all of our customers to this and integrate deeply with SignWell because it's such a good platform. So what I want to do here is show you how, uh, how easy it is to set up a template inside SignWell uh, and then how it works with Conveyor, how you can integrate uh, your e-signatures so that it pops up right inside your uh, Conveyor rep portal for them to sign, say, like their rep agreement or an affiliate agreement, okay? So uh, I'm going to go uh, to my SignWell account and I'm going to uh, say new template. I'm going to upload my template here. All right, we've got new affiliate agreement and we'll let it upload and that's it i just want that one document now the first thing it's going to ask you is what's going to be the like kind of the name of the person that is signing this what's their persona is how i think about it so i'm going to say affiliate so this is an affiliate i'm going to say prepare it's going to show me the document and i have found this to be way easier than some of the other ones uh things like adobe sign i've tried that one and it was very complex and you got to make sure you switch context and all this stuff it's kind of silly so in my opinion so now i'm just going to put in the, the the values that I need. So uh, this is, I'm gonna pause here and kind of just put in a couple and then I'll show you how I set them up. All right, the first placeholder I put in was a date field and I wanted this to be keyed off the, uh, the signing date. So I'm just gonna put lock signing date. Also, what's important is to make sure you put the uh, API ID uh, in there. It's gonna put in a value for you. I like to change these to be camel case. That's just me. You could leave it there if, you, if, you, if you're not gonna put any value uh, through in your API signature. So. Uh, next one is going to be uh, the name of the contact, so I'll go ahead and put in a text field. All right, and <clears throat> I'm going to come down here to advance. I'm persnickety about these things, so I want this to be affiliate name one. Okay, so I'm going to name it that, and then I'm just going to make sure this looks nice and pretty. Okay, and I'm just going to keep doing this for my other, uh, my other inputs, and I'll be right back. All right, I filled in all of my placeholders. I've made sure I've got names for each one of these uh, the way I want them. All right, and just double check and then say finish template. All right, now you can change this stuff. I don't use this because inside Conveyor, we're actually gonna embed this inside um, the uh, rep portal. And so I'll just leave that there. One thing to check, um, I, if you're gonna use Conveyor, make sure that this redirected page after signing is turned off, okay? Uh, we'll leave that there. I wanna turn send reminders um, off and I'll say save template. Okay, I've got my template now. I'm gonna click into the template, and what I want is this ID here, this template ID. Now let's head over to Conveyor, and I'm gonna go ahead and I've got a lesson that I've started. I'm gonna go use the SignWell uh, integration, and I'm gonna pop in the template ID. Here is this placeholder title. What I want is the affiliate value, and I'm gonna say sign affiliate agreement as the, the button name, okay? And then here, here where it says key and value, I'm gonna pre-fill uh, the values from uh, the contact uh, into the, um, you know, into the, 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 the sign well template that gets created. So I'm gonna pause here and fill this out, one sec. One little tip on this, uh, when you're filling it out, as, as uh, tempting as it is just to put the ones you remember, I like to put them in order from top down that I see in my agreement. It makes it easy to, re to, to double check to see if you have all of the values. Okay, I filled out all of the information for the pre-filled fields. I'm gonna click test mode while I'm testing this out and I'll go ahead and click save. Now, uh, what this is gonna do is it's gonna build the, um, the sign well and the template, create a, 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 a signature you know, template inside the portal and pop it up. Let me show you how it looks inside the portal, one second. Okay, here we have a super simple convey your affiliate workflow. And the first uh, lesson that I have uh, is our sign affiliate agreement. It's got that sign well, um, sign well setup. Okay, I put in all of the pre-filled values that I need. And I've just got kind of a little intro video about what convey your is. Probably would change that video to be something about, you know, uh, here's what, how the agreement works. And let me go over the agreement and explain it to you. Um, but this is just for demonstration purposes. Okay, so I've got that. We're gonna wait uh, until they sign the agreement, um, and then we're gonna nudge them if they haven't signed the agreement for a few times. After 30 days, I'm gonna send myself an email notification saying, this person never signed the agreement. Um, but if they do sign the agreement, we'll go straight to the next lesson, which is selling tips. So I can actually 
uh, lock this down to only let them see the next step once they've signed the agreement, okay? All right, let's go ahead and test it out. This is gonna build a little sample uh, portal for me. And I'm gonna oh, make this a little bigger so you can see it. I realize I'm on a big screen. So let's go uh, computer and I'll watch that video. Uh, and then I'll hit next on the video. Uh, and then it's gonna pop up the agreement right here on my page. Okay. So then I would just sign the agreement down here. All right, click signature. Yep, Mary McTesterson, save. And then agree and finish. And this will actually just take me uh, automatically to the end of the lesson, complete it, and then take me to selling tips, which I didn't have any content in. But you can see I was blocked from moving forward uh, once, once the, uh, only until the agreement was signed. And that has been a huge um, uh, headache for us with uh, other e-signing tools is not having that simple way of, uh, of uh, kind of popping up the agreement, letting them sign right there in place, uh, not making somebody break their pattern, look for an email or text message to come through uh, to sign the agreement, and it keeps people moving through the process much, uh, much more quickly. So again, that was a demonstration of how our eSign uh, works with SignWell, and I uh, just want to thank the SignWell team for all of the help uh, getting this rolled out for our team. We love it. Our customers love it. Thank you, SignWell team.